let's integrate 2x times e to the power negative x dx. Now, when you look at uh, an integral like this, you can see that you can't do a substitution. So the only possible way in which you can do is by integrating by parts. So let me write the rule of integrating by parts. Now, integrating by parts has come from the product rule of differentiation, integrating by parts. The rule is very simple. I'll only write the rule. I'll the pro Actually, this has come from the product rule. So the integrating by parts is like this. This is f, f of x times g dash x dx is equal to f of x times g of x minus integration of. I start with f of x here, so I'd write f dash x times g. If it's g dash x, you'd write g of x dx. Okay, now this has come from the product rule. You can prove this yourself. So this is not difficult to prove. Okay, so here the technique is, the skill is to let what is f of x and what is g of x. So here you've got two functions. One is f of x and the other is e of x. As a rule of a thumb, the function which is difficult to integrate, uh, you here both of them can be differentiated and integrated. Okay, so here you have to make a choice which you have to take as f of x and which you have to take as g dash x. So I'm going to let the first function is f of x. Okay, so as a rule of thumb, the function which is difficult to differentiate or difficult to integrate, you take that as g dash x. So f of x I'm taking as, I'm taking f of x as 2x. So the second function I'm taking as the derived function. I'm saying g dash x is equal to e to the power negative x. Okay, so when you, you have to now differentiate this because we need f dash x. So if I differentiate this, so this is differentiation. The, the derivative of 2x is 2. So here we are differentiating. So here this is differentiation. And now here we are integrating. Here we are integrating. Because from a gradient function, we are finding the function. So that is integration. So integration of e to the power minus x uh, is e to the power my suppose if you are differentiating this suppose what is e to the power what is the derivative of e to the power d by dx of e to, e to the power negative x well you have to differentiate inside so it is minus 1 times e to the power minus x in integrating you do the opposite you multiplied by minus 1 so you have to divide by minus 1 so this is e to the power minus x divided by minus 1, which is nothing but minus e to the power minus x. So differentiation of e to the power negative x and integration are one and the same. So let's apply the rule. So this implies integration of f of x. What is f of x? Is 2 of x, 2x times g dash x, which is e to the power minus x dx. So this is nothing but your question. Can you see this is your question? is equal to applying the formula f of x is 2x times g of x which is I'll put a minus out e to the power minus x minus integration of f dash x f dash x is 2 times integration of uh, 2 2 f dash x is 2 can you see and g of x is e to the power you got minus e, so let me put minus e to the power minus x dx. Okay, so this is, uh, this becomes minus 2x times e to the power minus x. This negative, this negative will make this negative positive. So this is plus, I'll factor the 2 out, e to the power minus x dx. Okay. So here we know already the integration of e to the power minus x is minus e to the power x. So this is minus 2x times e to the power minus x. And we know this is plus 2 times e to the power minus x divided by negative 1. Let me write it like this, plus c. 
So this integrates, the final answer is minus 2x e to the power minus x minus 2 e to the power minus x plus c. So this is your final answer. Uh, you can, uh, you don't need to factorize this. So this is your integration of integration of 2x e to the power minus x dx.